Good evening. As celebratory rallies continue and a curfew remains in place in Baltimore, hundreds in Toronto are showing their solidarity with Freddie Gray. Shauna Hunt with their rallying cry and the controversial police practice they want abolished here at home. Hundreds spilled into the streets calling for an end to police brutality. This march is in honor of Freddie Gray, a black man who was killed while in police custody in Baltimore. His death sparked riots in that city and more peaceful protests across North America. There doesn't need to be violence to, to make us seen. We're just, we're here. We're ready to fight peacefully. Toronto police on bikes accommodated the rally today, even as protesters ignored their barricades pushing through to the front steps of the U.S. consulate. The protest began outside police headquarters where there was a loud call to end carding, the controversial practice which allows officers to stop residents for no reason and catalog their personal information. They need to keep files on innocent people in a massive database that every single police officer in the city of Toronto can access. Is that what their job is? Well, the crowd here began booing when our new top cop was mentioned by a speaker up here on the microphone. It was just a few days ago when Chief Mark Saunders laid down the law with carding. He said it was a valuable policing tool and the controversial practice would not be abolished. I shouldn't be walking the streets worrying about being safe from police officers, worried about being carded and harassed for just walking the streets. 20 year old Braxton tells me he's been carded more times than he can count and it scares him. It's not fair that someone my age, Trayvon, Mike Brown, Eric Gardner, other young women and men are being murdered for just walking the streets, whether they have passed or not. They're, they're being judged on the cover, not their inside. The push to put an end to carding will continue. Organizers tell me we'll be seeing a lot more rallies just like this until the mayor and police chief take notice. Outside police headquarters, Shauna Hunt City News.